Welcome, Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus to your general message for the next 48 hours, okay? I'm T. Infinity back again with another message. So today, we will be taking a general look into your energy, into what Most High has for you, and what the Archangels will have to show you regarding money, family, um, health, and any um important messages okay so i was if you're new to my channel thank you for being here thank you for tuning in this is a general message it's not gonna resonate with everybody like share and subscribe hit that thumbs up and if it resonates with you hit that bell so you can be alerted when i upload new videos okay and um follow my ig for a chance to win a free reading or if you would like to book a personal, you can do that there as well. And like I said, comment below for that February 2022 giveaway, y'all, yeah, okay? So, um, I was about to say Gemini's. Cancers, I was getting that you have a lot of options. You have a lot of options right now. And you could be feeling confused about what to pick or about um, what to choose or about I also was getting to, you could be feeling like somebody else has a lot of options that you deal with. And it could be like messing with your security when it comes to yourself, okay? So the word for today was kindness, okay? The word for today was kindness, cancers. And kindness um, talks about being being um being how you would want others to be to you okay so let me see let's go ahead and get to this scripture that i have for today kindness february 8th 2022 be kind to each other tender-hearted forgiving one another just as god through christ has forgiven you ephesians 4 32 okay Kind people do themselves a favor, but cruel people bring trouble on themselves, okay? That was Proverbs eleven seventeen. So today you can ask yourself, how can you extend kindness to those around you, okay? All right? So Cancer, Summer, Rising, and Venus, without further ado, let's get into this message for you. Okay, so cancers. Cancers got options. Cancers got options. Most high, Mother Earth, Father God, Archangels of all four corners. Please allow us to channel the messages for the cancers, Sun, Moon, and Rising, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus today for uh, the next 48 hours. Please protect us as we look into this energy. Ashe, Ashe, Ashe. Look, the truth at the bottom of the deck. 3.33 on the clock. So, you could fuse cancers and you're wanting the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. Okay? You wanting the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. We gonna put that on out here. We gonna put that out here. So, cancers, they want the truth. You could be dealing with, I'm about to say, a Libra, Aquarius, or a Gemini. Yes, you want the truth when it comes to an Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini, or you want the truth when it comes to a marriage or a divorce, Cancers. That's what I'm hearing here. Most I please show us Cancers' um, most recent past energy. Thank you. Tower. So you have been getting karma, Cancers. You've been getting karma for something. You've been getting some type of karma. And clarity. That's what I'm seeing here. Yeah, when it comes to something that you're waiting on. Okay. A karmic maybe. Or this could. Yeah, I feel like that's a karmic. When it comes to a karmic. That um, you're waiting on. Or when it comes to. This could also be 444 on the clock. Somebody that you're waiting on. That you 
Cancer, you feel like this person is very sexy. You have a lot of passion towards this person. This person heals you. I'm hearing sexual healing with these two cards. And I feel like you feel burdened, Cancers. You feel burdened when it comes to this because you waiting on this person 33 right here. This could be your wife. Or this could be somebody you married to your husband. Okay, yeah, you want to take a leap of faith towards this person. You do. That's in your recent past. You wanted to take a leap of faith towards this person, okay? Yeah, from your past. Like I told you, six of cups. Okay, so your most recent energy was you having a divine intervention moment where you're being separated from the person from your past, okay? But somebody else, I feel like you want to walk away from you that is not because you're brokenhearted. This could be an Aquarius or a Gemini. Yeah, this person is keeping themselves bound to you, okay? But you want cancers. This is your energy. You want to work it out with the person from your past, Eight of Pentacles, this star here. The person that's very intuitive, very healed. This person that you turned your back on. You turned your back on this person. Y'all could have used to fight. Because I see you got, like, you've been through hell with this person, I feel like. Okay? And you having a tower moment when it comes to this person. But you feeling burdened because there's a karmic that does not want to let you go, Cancer. That's what I'm seeing here. All right? So, most high. What was the... uh? challenge what is the challenge for the next 48 hours for our cancers for you not to let some shit in for you not to let this person from your past walk out of your life that's what i'm hearing here yeah seven of swords but there's somebody that's being sneaky and doing magic on this person that's secluded from you that you that's victorious and successful Okay, it's somebody doing magic on this person. So we're going to get the energy around this cancer. Who is doing magic on this person? I feel like that you want this person to heal you from your past, but there's somebody that is making this a challenge for you. What is the energy behind this seven of swords with the magician and the death in reverse? Yeah, somebody that you don't want waiting on you or somebody that is waiting on you, Okay. Somebody that is waiting on you, but you don't want to wait on you is doing magic here. Okay? Give us some more energy surrounding this waiting in reverse with the Seven of Swords and the Magician. Mm-hmm. Okay. This is the person that you be sleeping in the room with. This is the person that's with you for money, Cancer. Okay, you go to rooms with this person, go out of town with this person. I'm seeing here, okay, this person stole something with you or this person is um, doing magic to steal your union, Cancer. Look how both of y'all in this red and white. You could have wore red and, red and white in your wedding. I'm hearing that for some of you, okay? This person is coming to steal that from you and your money, and your money because you see it, this is the money right here. And now this is the money open. This person wants this money from you. Okay, Cancer? That's what I'm seeing here. Yeah, because they waiting for your ships to come in. When it comes to y'all family, I feel like this is your wife and this is you. And you waiting for some ships to come in. And so is this person too. This person that's up here doing magic on you that you sleep in a hotel room with. Okay, this person that you got pregnant but did not have the child. Okay? They're, yeah, they're waiting to give... Um, somebody a message cancer or they're waiting for you to receive something cancer i feel like they waiting to give your um your significant other a message mm -hmm. and that's why they being sneaky seven of swords aquarius libra and gemini energy doing magic Mm -hmm. And that's why it's a challenge for you to be dealing with this person or for y'all to reconcile or anything like that. Yeah, a foe, a fucking hoe. Sorry to say it like that, but that's the energy that I'm getting off of that. Okay, so what's the higher? Thank you, the higher power. Love. Love is the higher power, Cancer. You really want this new opportunity with this love that... Uh, from this person that left you out in the cold, but you steady following behind this day going karmic, and that's why both of y'all are out here in the cold. Because you want this, your Ten of Cups, Cancer. Look at your energy coming right out. Because this person moved away from you, 
This person, spirit guides, guided them right, right away from you, Cancer. And you watch this person every single day. And somebody else watches this person too. Not just you, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini person. Yeah, because they, they don't want you to take action on this person, Cancer. They don't. They don't. They don't want you to have sex with this person, Cancer. This is your energy, King of Cups. Because they will be hurt. Ten of Swords, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini energy. And they will want to fight. And they're going to want to fight, okay? Yeah, if they find out that you're going to apologize to this person, they're going to want to fight Cancer. Straight up. Or they're going to want to kill somebody. Maybe you. But this person knows that you're hurt because of this situation. And they keep doing magic on you. And they keep doing magic on you. Keep doing magic on you so you can stay in poverty. Okay? But your higher power is your love. So what is the lower? What is the lower energy? What is the lower self? Your feelings. King of Cups. Your feelings. Okay? Your lower energy is your feelings because you fighting them. Cancer, you fight in your feelings. You fight in your feelings. That's why you feeling hurt because you got your ego up in the way. And that's why you broken hearted to this day because your pride and ego. Yep. So we're going to clarify this right here. Clarify this five of wands with this ten of swords with this king of cups for the cancers. Mm -hmm. Misfortune. Tore the hell up. Tore up from the flow up because of this third party situation. Mm-hmm. Wanted somebody to be in competition with you and whoever, and now somebody end up getting hurt and very hurt. Now you don't want this shit to end with the person from your past, Cancer. Sun, moon, rising, and Venus. You could have been dealing with a Scorpio. You could have been dealing with a Pisces. You could have been dealing with a Aquarius, a Libra, a Gemini. You could have been dealing with a... Aries, Leo, or Sag, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Take it how it resonates, okay, Cancer? But this is what it is. That's why you have having divine intervention, okay? That's why you have having divine intervention. So what is the advice? What is the advice for, uh, for the Cancer? What is the advice? You need to choose your path. You need to choose your path, Cancer, okay? Yeah, because this is a challenge. You did something, 1222. You did something that was, um, yeah, you moved too quickly into a situation. And now you want to apologize for it. Okay, you got all your armor on because you're still protecting yourself from whoever you're dealing with, Cancer. Okay, that you that you are, um, I'm hearing, you unequally giving and taking with somebody. Okay, you unequally giving and taking with somebody. Yeah, that's doing magic on you. Point blank period. And that's your advice, most I want you to know. And it's gonna continue to keep you in a conflict. Because you even you you not generously giving and taking, okay? You not you not you you breadcrumbing somebody else by giving to somebody else in this third party situation. So most I, yeah, secretly, secretly. You doing this shit secretly. Look, seven of cups came out. Didn't I say? And that's why you confused, Cancer. This is your energy. Moon card with the seven of cups. You could be drinking. You could be in fear of, you know, this situation coming to an end. You could also be in fear of this karmic walking away from you as well. That got you still left out in the cold, sleeping in hotels. Okay, but I just see a whole bunch of childish ass energy. This person is so childish. Are you dealing with a child? I hope not. This person looks childish. Okay? They look childish. When it comes to sex, when it comes to money, when it comes to stability, emotions. Yeah, and they just want to keep you in a third party, Cancer. Or this is you, very immature, wanting to stay in a third party. Once I said that's the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth, another night then came out. Because you want to move slowly towards your twin flame in this new cycle, 1414, that has the Ten of Pentacles and the Ace of Pentacles that you are being blocked from, that's single and abundant, that you cheated on cancer, that this person that you're dealing with is indecisive, about being with you because they don't want to let you go, but they know that you don't want to invest in them. 
Because you not. You got one pentacle towards them. And I already showed y'all the knight of pentacles. Same pentacle. Okay, but you sitting up here thinking about this third party situation. In fact, you want to reconcile. You want to reconcile, most I said, with your earth angel that you were supposed to be married to. Okay, yeah, but now you're sitting up here the wounded warrior while this person getting all their wishes fulfilled, Cancer, over some damn sex. And now you separated and cut off from this two of cups, 15, 15 on the clock. And that's why your ass is sitting over here confused. Cause you keep lying about stuff, Cancer. Okay, so what is what is this can what is this being kept from Cancers or that Cancers is keeping from somebody? The moon card and the seven of cups. Yeah, the side card. The person that's waiting for your ships to come in. Okay, Cancer. This person is secretly the foe. Why we showed you her. All right. So what is the outcome? What is the outcome for the cancers, most high? What is the outcome? Confusion. Okay, confusion, because you still want to deal with um, a narcissist. That's what I'm seeing here. You still want to deal with a narcissist, so it's going to be still confusion, because you still don't want to choose your path. You still don't want to choose your path, Cancers. You still want to be sneaky or deal with somebody that's sneaky, okay? When you don't need to deal with this person because they're going to keep on causing you conflict in your life. They're going to keep causing you conflict in your life. So that's the outcome. You seven and seven, okay? You're going to still be confused and having this tower moment because you don't want to let something in that's supposed to be dead, Okay? That's already dead. Most I clarify the tower right here. Yeah, service. The ancestors dead at this situation. So you need to let it go. Let it go and just go ahead with your foe. Just go ahead with the foe. That's what Most High is telling you. 17 on the clock. Okay? Because you being protected from this um, other person. You being protected from this other person. Okay? And what is this Ace of Swords here? Clarify the ace of swords. And as I said, yeah, that's the truth and the clarity that's going to surprise you, Cancers, when you get it. And it's going to cause you to be in despair. It's going to cause you to be in despair when you find out about this love situation. Okay? And that that was the outcome. Right? The ace of swords. The truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. Yeah, over money. Like I told you. Like I told you, Cancer. All over money. So last but not least, let's get some angel answers before we leave. Most hot. Cancers, think of a question. Someone rising in Venus. Most hot answer the Cancers questions that they will have at this time. Y'all hit that bell. And that thumbs up. Mm-hmm. Not the right time. Not the right time. Okay, y'all? So I hope y'all enjoyed this, and I'll see y'all in my next message. Look for a sign. Peace.